Welcome to E Music Live. We are America's best kept secret. We work in secret and exist in shadow. We are your best, last, and only line of defense against music mediocrity. The information you are about to receive is classified. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, is to learn to play the Men in Black movie theme on bass guitar. Thank you for joining us. with the uh, bass line to the Men in Black theme, uh, which was originally in a song by Patrice Russian that was made back in 1982. Uh, the song was called Forget Me Nots. Uh, you might get online and look that one up and listen to that one too if you're, trying, if you're into this kind of a bass line because it has some more variations on the bass line than the one in this uh, Men in Black theme. But we're going to stick to the Men in Black theme today. Uh, and also, I'm going to show you how to play it two ways. I'm going to play it with, we're going to use fingering with it first, just to show you uh, all the notes and everything. And then we'll start talking about uh, using the slap technique. Now, the slap, slapping technique is pretty tricky in this tune. It's not, you know, it's not real bad. But uh, I will uh, be producing a video about old school slap. So you might uh, stay tuned for that. You know, keep checking back with the eMusic live channel to see when that comes out but we're going to be putting together an old school slap video and I'm going to show you how to do a uh, traditional old school slap but on this one we're going to get right down to the song and uh, first we're going to go to a low F right here we're in the key of F on this or I think it's like F minor so so we're going to go from low F to high F like that now I'm, gonna, I'm just using my fingers right now, so we're not going to worry about slapping it right now. We want get to the, get the tune worked out. So F, high F, B flat, B flat right there. Okay, so B flat at the first fret. So if it was first fret with the F, third fret, high F, and then B flat. And then we're going to have to move and move out of that position and go up to uh, fourth position to C sharp then do an octave. Now, slapping is is really conducive to a lot of to uh, a lot of octaves. So, or, or octaves are conducive to slapping. So, when you use when you move up the neck, you want to go to C sharp and then high C sharp. Now, we're going to pull on that high C sharp like this. Like that to get that slapping sound. But you, I'm just using my finger for that. I'm just pinching it like that. So it's got like it's gonna be like this. So we went F, high F, B flat, up to C sharp, high C sharp, back to high C sharp, back to I'm sorry, back to C sharp. And then we're gonna move back down to position that, that we were in and do an E flat. Two E flats. And then we're going to hammer from B flat to C three times. Like that. So it's like this. F at high F, B flat, C sharp, high C sharp, back to C sharp. And then back down to E flat at the first fret. Then hammer on uh, with, we're going to hammer on C three times like that so just like that okay and then we're gonna move to the next part where we hammer on an F and that's gonna take us back to our low F so here we go and that brings us back to our low F one more time First 
half of the groove. The second half, we're going to go to when we, when we hammer on our E flat to get from E flat to F to get back to our F, we're going to go back to our original groove, F, high F, B flat, back to C sharp, and then we're going to okay. have our next move is that we're going to move up to F, third fret, and then we're going to hammer on to G like this. Now you're going to just do that with your finger. You're going to go, strike it one time, just like that. So we got, this is what we've got. Hammer. And then we're going to come back down and hammer from B flat to, to uh, C. Then we're going to move down to E flat to F and hammer on that. And so it's like this. So let's do that in slow motion. didn't do any pulling really I just used my uh, uh, middle finger down here to make that high sound on that uh, high um, C sharp so like that so that's what you're seeing or that's what you're hearing just pinch that string give it some nice attack so we've got this you see that Okay, now that's how you finger the tune. Now let me play it once, just so you hear what it sounds like. Okay, now that's what fingering. Now let's see if we can't work out a little slap on it okay so what we're gonna do with our slapping is actually we're gonna use our thumb and I use my middle finger for slapping okay and pulling okay so what I'm gonna do is do this so when I go up I'm gonna come down with hammer down with my thumb pull up with my middle finger like that and I'm gonna do that on every octave when I go down to the F like that, and I'm going to move up, and I'm going to hammer most of the other notes. Okay, so let's, let's try that. Okay, let's talk about how we're going to do some uh, hammer style playing of this song, or, or, uh, or, or slapping on, on the bass. So we're going to hammer and pull. We're going to be using our thumb to hit the notes like that, and then I'm going to use my middle finger to pull up on the notes, like that, and I do my pulls. And we're going to use that technique on all the octaves. So I'm going down with my thumb, just kind of clipping the string there, not pulling it very hard. So I'm getting that, in. like that. Hammering down, pulling up. Okay, so let's try that. And I hammer down on that B flat, then hammer down on the C sharp, pulled up hammer down, pulled up on the high C sharp, and hammer back down on the uh, low C sharp. So it's... Sorry. Like that. Let's try that again. And then when I move back down to my E flat, hammered. 
So it's and I went. Hammer simultaneously pulled up and hammered down on the F, high F. Like that. So we got. did that I pulled up on that string and hammered down with my fingers like that and then come back down to uh, B flat hammer on a C theme on bass. The information you have just witnessed is classified. This lesson will self-destruct in one second. Sorry.